Well, it's going to make me have to drive about another 20 miles unless I go gravel road. Going gravel, drivers say it'll be a long, bumpy ride as the regular highway is under construction. The closure of a highway could leave a mid-Missouri city stranded. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jim Reed. And I'm Angie Bailey. Thanks for joining us with more on this. We have KOMU 8's Jordan Vanderberg live in Studio 8B. Jordan, what has California residents so worried? Well, Jim and Angie, MoDOT plans on temporarily closing Route 87 in about two weeks in order to connect to a new portion of the highway they're building. Let's take a look at exactly what portion of 87 is going to be affected. As we can see, we've got, route, we've got Highway 50 here in South Oak Street, also known as Missouri 87. The construction is actually set to begin further south of downtown on Gerhardt Road, right where it connects with Missouri 87. Now, the big problem with this construction is that it spans for a 10-mile range, roughly, where it connects with Missouri Y, and this leaves many homes and businesses stranded and cut off from the rest of mid-Missouri. Progress can sometimes be like a gravel road. At times, it comes at the price of losing some smoothness. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. All right. Joyce Harris works at Burger Smokehouse in California. Her usual drive to work is about 20 miles, but with the upcoming road work... That's going to make my commute to work about 40, 45 miles a day, one way. So it's going to be quite a bit of inconvenience. Harris isn't alone. For President Stephen Berger, the detour creates a logistical nightmare. Uh, some of our employees will have to reroute their, their trips to and from the plant due to the closure. Uh, <clears throat> some of our customers that come from uh, north of 87 will have to, to reroute or wait till after the road opens back up. Berger will tell you the closure of Highway 87 will delay most of his deliveries. But in the long haul, he says it'll all be worth it. The completion of the road uh, in, in the long term, positive benefits of that road are going to far outweigh uh, any, any short-term inconveniences we're going to face in the, in the next uh, several weeks. Thank you very much. Harris would rather not use the gravel roads instead of the detour, but she just might have to. Blame it on the price of progress. Sometimes I guess that's what you have to do is, you know, be a little inconven inconvenience to, you know, have progress come about. MoDOT issued a news release this afternoon saying it understands the inconvenience of the closure. It, off, it plans to offer the contractor a $25,000 incentive for finishing within five days of the 21-day project. The contract stand, spans for 21 days, so I guess we'll have to find out if they make that incentive or not. Angie, back to you in the studio. Okay.